actor. Where did the ambition to be an actor kick in first? Um, well, I mean, I, I sort of did it a bit at school. I mean, I guess I was always someone who, who, I mean, sounds terrible, but needed attention. I mean, you know, big family it's and the show off gene. Like I loved. Um, Do they all have it? Do the four, all five of you have it? Or the or, show off gene? Yeah. I mean, I don't know if it's a show off gene because I. A show off gene. But 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 you say that, but. Um, I was incredibly, in in really, nice... really, really shy. Like yeah, incredibly yeah. shy. Are. are they? Yeah, I suppose they yeah, are. Yeah, I think so. Is I think because you'd be an introvert, oddly, although yes. you're professionally extrovert, you're yeah. standing on stages and and putting your your life on paper and yeah. bringing it. Most people I meet doing this job who, who, who are actually they don't like social situations necessarily yeah, you wouldn't draw either. attention to yourself in a big room full of people unless you were on the stage demanding the attention That's of the entire room absolutely true yeah I'm, I'm really awkward yeah um, generally but i but i think it must just be from coming from a big family like i remember the way i sort of attracted my parents attention was to make them laugh okay so i'd say that was the first sort of um germ of it and then in school i think i wasn't like super uh academic like I was fine it was kind of average um but but then again it was it was a way to sort of you know and would you get big up. parts would you get lead roles and stuff like that uh well I mean it was a common school so there wasn't a huge a lot of you know it wasn't an all singing all dancing kind of creative environment our 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 head nun would put on a, a Gilbert and Sullivan <laughs> opera every year so you got you got your chance to to shine <laughs> and you heavy were shy, pan sticked. Yes, um, but playing what sort of roles did the young well, Sharon Horgan secure? I, I, I played Puva in, well, in the Mikado. So yes, is the answer. You did. You got you got the leads, <laughs> or at least one. <laughs> we used to do this thing like every time it was um, a Saint's Day, or you know, so each of the classrooms were named after a, a saint. When their day came up, you'd put on a play about that saint. So you kind of, you could be quite creative with that. It was the one time you could be sort of sacrilegious. It needs sort of... a red button for people that didn't go to Catholic school, doesn't it? Really, yeah. every every classroom is named after a saint and we do a little play every day. Yeah. We used to try and find, when it was con confirmation time, we used to get the butler's lives of the saints and try and find the most obscure and ridiculous yeah. name possible for a, and then sit there and go, yes, I'd like to be known as Mungo. <laughs> This, uh, they yeah. couldn't they couldn't get cross with us because it was yeah. actually but yeah so for people who didn't go to that kind of school this is an education and and you knew I mean you go home I sense that you were raised all of you in a way that made you think anything was possible given what you've all done subsequently so you wouldn't have gone home and said I want to be an actress when I grow up and they'd have gone don't be ridiculous you're, you're gonna be you're, well, you're taking over the turkey no, farm I, I think, acting's not for, acting's no, not no. for the likes of us I think my, the last thing my dad would have wanted is for any of us to go into turkeys but I mean, no, I, you, you could, you could, you know, they, they were ambitious for us for sure. I honestly don't know where we got it from. It's not like we were sort of, you know, um, pushed in any way. I don't know. I think my, my eldest sister, Maria, yes. was, um, she went to Trinity and she became a documentary maker. And I, I kind of think, I mean, apart from Shane's obvious, you know, um, God given talent, I think it was just sort of seeing her do it. Like we were kind of surprised that suddenly, Maria was doing this very creative kind of rewarding thing. And I think we sort of looked at her and thought, well, then well, we, we can, you know, I think. Yeah, no, it doesn't mean it will happen, but, yeah. it, but it means that you've got the confidence to yeah. at least think it could and therefore give it a whirl. Yeah. I remember telling my mother quite early doors what I was going <laughs> to achieve and her being a little bit like, you know. How early se doors? Se settle down. How early doors? Um, I don't know. I guess I was sort of mid-teens, mid oh, okay. you know. okay. And you yeah. were saying I'm going to win Oscars. Or... I actually do remember saying that yeah. very thing. Did you really? Yes. Well. And I think she said, you know, calm, calm down. Bath a little. would be fine. She was, yeah, <laughs> she should have said that, yeah. <laughs>